Hello ladies and gentlemen, Johnny and John are not here with another Gran Turismo Sport video and today I'll be showing you my drift build for the RX-7. So the RX-7 or FD for you JDM nerds was released along with a number of other vehicles in late December 2017. Not too many drift builds have come up so this will be my take on the matter. Alright let's get to it. Alright. So power level or power ratio I guess 110% weight reduction 86% you're gonna have to level that all the way up traction control zero comfort hards on both tires no brake balance right height height right height all the way to the bottom lowest that you can do natural frequency 1.7 on both anti-roll bars 7 on the front 4 on the back compression 60 60 rebound 90 in both Negative camber angle on the front, 0.5, on the back, 1.5. Toe angle, 0, on the back, 0.6. Downforce, 0, on the LSD, 5, 5. So 5 initial, 5 acceleration, and 50 on brakes and braking sensitivity. Uh, transmission, set top speed of 270 kilometers or in feet feet so 270 kilometers per hour or 167 miles per hour all right here we are on the drift trial for suzuka east and before we even start drifting there is many settings that you must have first of all manual transmission for some reason there's still people driving with an automatic transmission i don't know why People do it, doesn't make sense. Manual transmission. Trash control off. Auto drive off. Oh shit. Auto drive off. Driving line assist. You can. If you want, you can keep the, any of those things on, but usually you don't. Brake indicator, same thing. ASM off. Counter steering off. ABS off. Some people like to run it. I used to run weak, but then I just don't run it at all. Uh, let's see. Controller sensitivity 7. You want the max sensitivity to have the most control, I guess. Force feedback max torque 10. So you can feel the torque. Feel it through your fingertips. Feel it through your bones. And that's it. Let's get started. Not the greatest of runs, a bit sloppy, but as you can see I did drift in second gear. I did switch a third gear a few times to extend it. This is a lower power drift build, as you see you can right here, you can see right here, 321 horsepower, that's not too uh, far off from, what is the stock? 292, yeah, just, I kept it low because I kept on spinning out, I also suck at this game, just kidding. I'll keep that out. But yeah, I kept it low because I kept on spinning out. And this is what worked out for me. Thank you for watching. Like the video if you like the video. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, joys, blah, blah, blah. Tell me what you thought of the drift build. Does it work out for you? Any adjustments I should try out? Just let me know in the comments. DM me. Follow me. I'm just kidding. 
and subscribe to keep up with any other drift builds, any other content I upload. Thank you for watching, and I hope you have a lovely day or night, wherever you may be.